My name is Paul Rebessa and I had the privilege of serving as the ADRA CEO for about three years from late 2017. I have so many great memories of my time at ADRA. I won't lie, there were some tough days as well, but whenever you got to experience the work of ADRA firsthand, all of those challenges and difficulties, they tended to fade away. Uh, and your energy tended to come back really, really quickly. And I recall uh, one night I was in Brisbane lying awake in my hotel room. Earlier that day we'd spent time touring around ADRA projects in South Queensland and then in the evening we volunteered with an ADRA project known as Vital Connections. And Vital Connections took warm food to people who were struggling near the CBD. So I just worked alongside all the other volunteers. We made food, we put it in the van, we drove it to the city, we served the people, we mingled and ate with them, and then we loaded it all back in, headed back to the kitchen, did the dishes, swept the floor, locked up. It was a long night. It was a busy night, it was a late night, but it was a fantastic night. And it was later that night when I'm lying awake from just the joy of serving other people. And it was that night that I remember thinking what Jesus said long ago, that it's better to give than it is to receive, was absolutely true. And if there's a highlight with inside that highlight, it was meeting a young man called Mikey. Mikey was a volunteer with that ADRA project and he worked tirelessly that night as did all the volunteers. But that was Mikey's third night volunteering that week, committing about six hours each time. And as I was chatting to Mikey, he said that ADRA project had changed his life. Here's Mikey trying to change someone else's life, finding his own life changed. And I guess as I reflect on my ADRA experience, uh, Mikey's story became my story because ADRA changed me much more than I ever changed it. So ADRA, I'd say congratulations on 40 years. That's a fantastic achievement. And I just pray that as you go forward, you continue with those values of being connected, being compassionate, being courageous, just as Jesus modeled for us, because your impact will continue to grow.